to the King's most excellent majesty and to her most gracious majesty the Queen. May it please your majesties, we, the mayor and all the men and burgesses of the county borough of Gateshead, beg most respectfully to express our gratitude and thanks that upon the occasion of the official opening of Pine Bridge, your majesties have graciously consented to visit Gateshead. We humbly offer to your Majesty the warm and beautiful welcome to our ancient town, with the assurance of our whole heart and faithful allegiance to your Majesty's and the throne. We, in common with all other loyal British subjects, gratefully realize how fully your Majesty's, whether in time of prosperity or adversity, have ever manifested a gracious and ready interest and sympathy with your people. And our earnest prayer is that in the providence of Almighty God, health and strength with divine guidance may be granted to your majesties to reign over the great British Empire for many years to come. Given under our corporate seal this third day of October, 1928. W. Edwin Ward, Mayor, W. Swinburne, Town Clerk. Queen and I thank you for your loyal and dutiful address and its words of cordial welcome. It is a great pleasure to us to visit Gateshead on the occasion of opening the new bridge which so nobly spans the river Tyne and forms another great highway between the two countries. I am happy to recall the visit paid to the ancient town of Gateshead by my dear father when he opened the King Edward VII Bridge. The similar ceremony which we are today performing forges a fresh link in the chain associating my family with the Tyneside town. I warmly congratulate you on joining with your neighbors to erect the new bridge. It is a worthy testimony to the energy and foresight which enabled the Tyneside towns to take their full and honorable share in the industrial development of Great Britain. I have noted with deep solicitude how many formerly prosperous industries have been and are still passing through times of depression. It is therefore all the more gratifying to know that much as your town has suffered, you've shown your enlightened public spirit in proceeding with this great civic enterprise. Those who have planned, designed and executed this work may justly be proud of their labor. I pray that with God's blessing, more prosperous times may soon return that your trade may reap the benefit of these improved communications. 